I'm an idiot. There we go. It's showtime! I don't deserve okay. enough hours, if I'm being honest. Like, what am I even contributing? Okay. Wait, what the? Why are the buildings moving? There's already a superhero with a red suit with a lightning bolt on it. A flash? He's literally huge and he's so manly. The Batman, it was so cool. And oh! I'll just mentioned really? Ben Affleck. <laughs> Oh, that's gotta hurt. I feel like a fraud. It doesn't matter. Um, anyway, the wizard gave me superpowers. When well, everybody got superpowers, where's everyone going? To fight crime? <laughs> okay. Now everyone's kind of like doing their own thing. Okay. And everyone's trying to keep it together. You understand I'm a pediatrician, <laughs> right? Who's <laughs> that? Was that the one though? The fate of the world depends on it. I'll look later. The daughters of Atlas are coming for you. Children's talk. And then, okay. This is very personal. Oh. Look, I might not have as much experience as you because I'm not super old like you. <laughs> but I've seen all of the Fast and the Furious movies, lady. It's all about. Okay, that's pretty tough. That's pretty tough. The world will not survive this. I don't know how we fight powers like this. You think I know how to fix this dude, but I really don't. Everyone can be worthy. Give it a chance. Now go fight for your family. Go fight for the world. They made his powers look pretty cooler. Okay. <laughs> I just threw a truck at a dragon. I love my life. <laughs> okay. All right. Only in theaters one. Oh, they didn't give us a date. Well, actually, they probably did. I just didn't see it. No, nah, never mind. But either way, that actually looked way better than I thought it was going to be. Obviously, Zachary Levi. Still his funny old self. <laughs> but let's go back to this one scene, the pediatrician scene. Where's, where's the scene where he's just sitting there and then all of a sudden... There was a doll that I hope was not in that pediatrician's office. It was like for a split second it was there. One sec. It was like right there. I hope it wasn't the doll I'm thinking of because if it is, that's creepy. Okay, what the heck. Here we go, here we go. It was like right... Why the heck is that in the movie? You guys know what doll that is. I'm not saying its name. I'm definitely not. I don't want no bad luck. But you guys know what type of doll that is. You've seen the movie. You've seen the scary movie. Why is it... What is it doing here? Why does this guy have this doll in a kid's pediatrician center? I see Wonder Woman, I see Batman. A lot of Wonder Woman, bro. You you got a problem. <laughs> He's got a problem. And I'm guessing, wait, is that Robin? And Green Lantern? Wait. Don't tell me you're giving hints, DC. Don't you dare tell me, don't you dare tell me you're giving hints. I just hope that's not a hint. I don't need another movie of that. But anyways, moving on. This guy's a sicko. <laughs> but yeah. So far, I like the idea of this movie. I don't know who the heck these two are, but I'm guessing they're super powerful and they're gonna end the world or whatever. But I like the... Where's the scene where they all transformed? I I also, I also I like the whole idea of Shazam. I like how it's a kid turning into a superhero the way he is. And then this scene was pretty funny because I think she was in the Fast and the Furious. I think she played the... You know, but I like the new suit. I like the way the new suit looks like the, the first one kind of looked a little, you know, like, yeah, 
it's new. But I like the design right here. I like the way the Thunderbolt looks right here. It looks a little more, I want to say Roman. And that makes sense. But I, I hope in this movie, towards the end, we get a little sign that Black Adam's going to be in this movie. This transformation right here was so tough. This was so tough. And the suits, look at everybody's suit. Like, I just feel like everybody got to level up or something. Like, everybody. And then Megan Good's in this. And then I like all I like all their suits. And the belts look better. Thank goodness for that. But this looks really good. Like, I think this is going to be a good movie. I think this is. I'll watch it. I'll definitely watch this. But this is going to be tough. I don't know who the heck that was. But they got to give us something in this movie towards the end. They got to give us another superhero. They got to give us something to get excited for. Give us Static Shock. Give us... Heck, give us a, a Squirrel Girl. I'm just messing. But give us somebody. But I think this is definitely going to be a good movie. And then the damage on the suit. Jeez, I hope that cleans up pretty nice. Because that's a nice suit. And I don't want it to get all dirty. Or messed up. But either way... I like the trailer. That made me want to watch it. So I'll give it a 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10 only because it's Shazam and it's not Henry Cavill. But still, very good trailer. Anyways, 9 out of 10 and next.